Good day everyone! In today's video, we will be learning about voluntary and involuntary actions. First, let us look on to the voluntary actions. Voluntary actions are actions that are in your control. For example, you are waking up early in the morning, getting ready, going to school. These are all voluntary actions. You want yourself to do that. Muscles contract, relax, and facilitate a movement. Examples of voluntary actions are running, eating, speaking, reading, etc. How does this happen? First, the stimulus sends information directly to the brain or the spinal cord through receptors. Then the brain processes this information and sends the signals as motor impulses to the specific effector and, the, and then to the muscle or gland for response. Now let us look on to involuntary actions. Involuntary actions are actions that are not in our control and are done unconsciously. Examples are our eyes blinking and our heart beating. You can never control this. The involuntary actions are not controlled by our brain or spinal cord. Hence, are controlled by some parts of the central nervous system, such as medulla oblongata, hypothalamus and the spinal cord. These were the differences between voluntary and involuntary actions. I hope you understood the lesson. If you have any more questions, put them in the comments below. Thank you.